What is up, y'all? It's your boy Duck here. My thoughts on One Piece chapter 819. And man, Jack is back and he's ready to attack the whole fucking island. How the fuck you gonna kill the island, nigga? How the fuck you gonna kill that big ass elephant? Like, what the fuck is he gonna do? Is this nigga really planning on. Like, come on, man. Stop with the bullshit. Why you always gotta do all this extra shit, Jack? Always. But I love it, though. I'm loving it. So now, we about to put beat the brakes off this nigga for coming back. So my man, somebody, I don't know. I don't think Luffy gonna be it. Well, he still, he probably, he probably still gonna be there. So we about to beat the brakes off Jack. Send his ass back. And then we gonna uh, wait for Luffy to get back from Big Mom's crib. Or Big Cake Island, whatever it's called. So we can head on over to Wano country because now we finally, well, we are in an alliance with the Minx. I mean, with Minx and the Minx and with uh, Law. Because now, because this is going to be our best chance to take down Kaido. Now that we got a whole fucking species of people on our side, motherfucker, we got a whole island on our side and we about to go to another island. So now, I don't know if Kaido is on Wano Kuni, but, I, but we know it's pirate crew there. And we know that there's people on the Wano Kuni that's, you know, already part of the, you know, part of our, you know, little team. Already part of our little rebellion. Not the rebellion, but, you know, they already have have a little rebellion team set up in Wano Kuni. So we're going to go there, meet up with them, and we're going to show out and fuck their ass up, man. Because what they did to uh, Momonosuke's people, his mom and his pop, we're going to have to fuck these niggas up, man. We got to. Kaido and the Shogun. But uh, we just going to have to wait and see uh, whatever the fuck. When, whenever. We just have to wait and see if Kaido there or not. Because if, he, if he's there and we have to fight him and the Shogun, like, I don't, I don't know if we can win that. Because we... Like they said, we on they Jack was enough to fucking, you know, do a whole bunch of damage to them. But we the mix ain't even go all out yet. Let me hold on. Yeah, he said the mix ain't even go all out yet. They gonna show their true strength. So we can't we gotta wait. We gotta wait to see that. Motherfucker Jack's I mean, Kaido still got two more, you know, retainers, like two more powerful people on the side, I think. So we gonna we're gonna have to wait and see that. And plus they probably got powerful people under them, so come to for like Nigga. But if we handle Jack right now, all we got to do is deal with two more people. But I don't think we're going to beat Jack just yet. Probably. But we might whoop his ass. We're going to whoop his ass. Because motherfucker, if Fujitora and Sengoku wasn't enough to whoop this nigga ass. Like, come on. we I mean, he injured, though. So we might be able to whoop his ass or send him packing. So we're going to see. Um, Momonosuke finally... Luffy forced that nigga to be adult, be an adult, man. Like nigga, this is your responsibility. You can't act, be asking your retainers to do some shit that you're supposed to be doing, nigga. If you want to be in alliance with us, you gotta man up and humble yourself and come before me and ask for help, homie. You can't just fucking have your have motherfuckers who are under you do that, man. If you call yourself the motherfucking big shot, nigga, come to me, man. Just like he just like he had to learn to bow his head down in Drum Kingdom. Momonosuke had to bow his head down to ask for help, man. And that's what he talked to nigga, man. And I'm proud of Luffy, man, because everybody was like, nah. Luffy was like, fuck that shit, nigga. You you gonna be a man, be a man. Not just in title, but in actions too, homie. And I'm glad he did it. So Momonosuke can be a when he grow up, he gonna be Motherfucking badass too. He probably be the next Shogun. I'm not the next, but you know, be the be a motherfucking Shogun, hopefully. But anyway, um, what else happened in this chapter? They talked about Nekomamushi's and Inuarashi's past, and it happened before, like Oda was killed. They came back and they started fighting and shit. It happened way before Oda was killed, way before even Momonosuke was born, because. Carrot was like, I was still a baby then, or before, I, I don't know. I think she said it was before I was even born. 
So yeah, whatever the fuck happened between them, we gotta wait and see that shit. It's just so much more questions to be asked and more shit to be seen. But for right now, we about to go hit up Sanji. Try to get Sanji back. But we gonna get him back. And then we gonna fuck up Wano Kuni. So the rest of the crew just gonna have to sit still and uh, fuck up Jack if the nigga come attacking. So anyway, it's been your boy, Duck, here with my thoughts on One Piece, chapter 819. Pretty good chapter. I liked a lot of stuff in it. And I can't wait to see next week's chapter. Yes, I thought it was going to go on break, but nigga ain't no break next week. Ain't said at the end of the chapter. So we're going to see. I'll see y'all niggas later. What are y'all thoughts on the chapter? Leave them in the comment section below. And peace until next week.